is guys and welcome back to another video. Today we're gonna take on Kanto Challenge Champion Stadium Week 18 Master Mode. So for the past 17 weeks, we did this last year, 2020, and this is the first week of Kanto Challenge Master Mode, uh, 2021 on February. So I would say that this week's Master Mode is actually very easy and I actually spent only 1.5 hours instead of 10 hours. And yeah, Lance and Lorelai is going to be 900 points. Agatha and Bruno is going to be 800 points. Blue is going to be 950 points. I would say that if I spend a bit more time, I could actually get this to 5,000 points, but I didn't want to spend so much time because I'm really busy. So yeah, the main reason I go for Lance and Lorelai for 900 because the teams I'm going to use are actually very easy and simple to use. Agatha being 800 because I want to make my battle myself a bit easier. Bruno being 800 is just an accident. I didn't mean to do it. 950 is just to replace the missing 50s from Agatha and Bruno. So yeah, without further ado, let us begin. And make sure to like and subscribe if you haven't, and there will be secret details and bloopers at the end. See you later. Here we come! Now! Let's go! Come on! Take this! You can do it! Stop. 
true power of ninja techniques. yourself now now here we come huh. ah. roasted now huh. oh. Get this started, shall we? Get ready! Let me throw! Ready! Blast! Focus! It's time! Let go! Stop! 
Ready!
you point out where I went wrong? <laughs> yeah! Am I great or what? So this is going to be uh, my candle challenge week 18 master mode and we're going to quickly recap the sync press I used for each stage. Round 1 battling Lance using Koga, Skyla and Rosa. Round 2 battling Lorelai using Jasmine, Cygnus Red and Blaine. Round 3 battling Agatha, we used Viola, Fantina and Misty. Round 4 battling Bruno using Dawn, Sabrina and Caitlyn. Round 5 Battling in Blue using Signature Blue, Wallace, and the Signature Leaf. Note that this week's Bruno stage is the same as Jodo's Psychic stage, so you can just use uh, what you use in Jodo's Psychic stage for Kanto Psychic stage as well. And yeah, let's take a look at the Sync Grid studio as usual. First is going to be Koga. So Koga is very simple, I didn't invest on anything else, so not very, nothing too special to say about. For Rosa, nothing very special either. Just go for some simple buffs and that's basically it. Those MP refreshers won't help too much in last battle. A Skyla, mainly go for a staggering one, take flight, a master healer, master healer, potion MP refresh, and potion MP refresh, then you're good. This is a very good and very ex and really excellent uh, single build because it ensures you to have unlimited potions. Next for Jasmine. Jasmine, I ain't have. I don't have anything too special. Just mainly get it to tank. And Jasmine is going to have that X special defense. So and refresh kind of important to buff your side as well. For Red, uh, it's usual a Haymaker Solar Flare build, which is very simple, and many of you should be very familiar with it. For Blaine, there won't be a sync grid because Blaine doesn't have one yet. I wish Blaine had like every fresh sunny day, which is really good. Next up, Agatha. So first for Viola, mainly go for the uh, mainly go for stationary target poke trap, stationary target, and struggle box move butter fresh. And yeah, that's basically it. Nothing else too important. Next we have Fantina. Fantina. For Fantina, I have Critical Will, raises special defense while letting, when, when letting critical hit, and special attack and pre refresh, dance with me and pre refresh, shadow ball move guard refresh 2 on a row, which lowers the special defense of the opposing. So you need to buff your critical hit yourself instead of uh, bu using Torchic or other members. So keep this in mind. Go for dance with me like twice or three times, and then you're good, and you can land some very good critical hits. Next, with Misty. Misty, we have Eagle Entry 1, and an X Special Defense Saw, and that's basically it. You can also go for a Bubble Bee Move Got Refresh, and a Catch If You Can MP Refresh. So make sure that Misty is like plus 5 Visionist, then. Uh, Stormy can dodge many moves like Hex, Sludge Bomb, Dazzling, Gleam, Ice Punch, Shadow Punch, Fire Beam, Will with all those moves, then you can dodge them very easily. Make sure they aim for the sides, be being Smages and Dusting all first because they hit really hard, and you don't want to get a Blizzard in the face. For Bruno, first we have Dawn. Dawn is a very simple grid and only has X Special Defense all. Okay, X Special Defense all, Raise the Leaf move, got you fresh. We have C bomb move card refresh, which is not important, and we have good as new friendly shield. That's basically it. Very simple grid. Fire five will be even better. Next we have Sabrina. For Sabrina, it's also a very simple grid. Let me just find it very quickly. Where is Sabrina? Sabrina, Sabrina, Sabrina. There you go. For Sabrina, reflect and pre refresh four. Dark Hit All and Pre Refresh, Grand Entry, and Six Sense and Pre Refresh. Mainly go for Six Sense and Pre Refresh to heal up Caitlyn and Dawn. Uh, you don't have to heal 
Alakazam because Alakazam is very frail. Dark Hit and Refresh is very important, and Reflect and Refresh is uh, useful as well. Next, we have Caitlyn, a grid that I really like a lot. And my Caitlyn is, is 4 out of 5. We have Broken Sleep Psychic, Hidden Power Proportion 1, Revenge Boost, the Don't Bore Me, Healthy Healing, Caitlyn Carr, Healing Herself, Hidden Power, and Move Guard Refresh. I really suggest you guys to copy this moveset. Or, no, I, I really suggest you guys to try and copy this. Uh, sync grid if you have Kaden 3 out of 5 or above because Kaden is actually really good as a tank as well as a striker so so try using Kaden especially for Cynthia's team Cynthia, Isarola and Kaden can also do really well together next we have Blue so first we're gonna take on take a look at SS Blue I don't want to show my sync grid too much here because that, mine is only 1 out of 5 but you guys have, it, have him 3 out of 5 3 out of 5 that would be awesome and I would suggest you guys to get him to 3 out of 5 but which I don't and I'm so sad Next, for wallets, nothing too special either since mine is only 1 out of 5 and I have invested nothing so like you can invest on whatever you like I'm not gonna say about anything For Sickness and Leaf, mine is 2 out of 5 but 3 out of 5 with Master Healer and pre will be even better First, let's take a look at the Potent, Ton Potent Toxic 2 Potion and pre Fresh Mega Healing and pre Fresh and yeah, that's basically it. 35 get the Master Healer 1 and Master Healer 1 will be even better. But if you don't, it's fine. Uh, another alternative for Signal Leaf is going to be Koga, which Koga still works really well with the big poison and make use of the effect. So yeah, this is going to be it for all my Syncrets. And let me quickly also show you my lucky skills. So, Skyla is Vigilance. Rosa is Vigilance. I don't think Koga has one. So Koga doesn't have one. For Jasmine, I have uh, Vigilance. Jasmine for Vigilance. Red for Critical Strike 2. Blaine doesn't have one. Viola doesn't have one. Fantina having her Critical Strike 2. Misty having Vigilance. I got this Vigilance from a 2 star Lucky Cookie. But you can get it from a 3 star Lucky Cookie as well. For Bruno, I got Dawn Fighting Guard from Jolo Champion Stadium because I I struggled against Bruno for a long time. So Fighting Guard helps me a lot and help would help you as well. Another alternative is going to be Defense Crush 2, which ain't helped a lot. But any don't go for Vigilance because Dawn already has Vigilance in his passive skills. So any any lucky skill would do so. Sabrina having Static 1, raising its defense occasionally. Kaden doesn't have a sync move. No. Kaden doesn't have a lucky skill. Signal Suit Plus doesn't have a signal have doesn't have a lucky skill, but I would suggest uh, vigilance. Wallace and Signal Suit Leaf does not have a lucky skill as well. So yeah, this is going to be it, and hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I hope uh, this guide helped you out a bit, whether you did or not. Let me know what sync pads you used for master mode. And yeah, this is going to be it for now. And I hope you have, and, I, and I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like and subscribe to the event. And before we end this video, there will be a blooper at the end because I'm always very unlucky. So enjoy the blooper, and I'll see you next time. See ya.